Good morning guys, happy new year. I'm actually in Jacksonville today. I'm visiting some family. Um, came here for the weekend and uh, it's about seven in the morning. I decided to get up early and check out one of the beaches here. I've been wanting to surf fish here because there's a lot of, uh, there's a lot more species active in the surf on the east side, on the east coast of Florida. And uh, I'm excited because I watched some YouTubers over here on this side and saw a lot of red drum, black drum, pompano, whiting, all the good stuff like that. So I brought three rods with me. I'm gonna get set up and hopefully we get on some fish. I still need to swing by the bait shop. I'm not sure what I'm gonna use yet. I'm probably gonna ask them what they recommend. It's a little windy today, but I'm gonna get out there and see what happens because this is about the only time that I had. So gotta make it count. Let's go catch some fish. All right, so I just made it to the beach. I've got three poles rigged up. This is supposed to be a beach that you can drive on, which is why I came here. But that dude is digging up some sand and placing it so people can drive better. So I had to haul my stuff quite a bit of ways, but it wasn't too bad. But uh, I've got a bunch of bait. I just bought a variety of bait. I got. Uh, some mud minnows down there. I've got fresh dead shrimp and I've got blue crab. So a variety of bait, I'm gonna toss them all out and see what they're wanting today. I got all set up, left my GoPro in the truck. So I'm running back to get it real quick. So I cut up these crab knuckles and uh, I would have recorded it, but like I said, I left my GoPro in the truck but you basically cut the top off cut the legs off and you just got these joints here and run the hook through that right through the joint through this hard part Oh man, oh man, big bite, big bite, big bite. Oh man, whoo. Oh, and I dropped my phone in the water. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh man. Oh, this is a mess. This is a mess. I'm so glad I didn't lose my phone. I just bought that dang thing. My God. That was, oh man, I might have came off. No, still on. Oh man. Jeez. The pole was bent over. I ran, dropped my phone in the back pocket. My goodness. I hope this isn't a stingray because it feels like it's pulling 
towards the bottom. Let's see, am I? No. Not yet. I'm gonna get my pliers out here just in case it is a stingray. Yeah, it feels like a stingray though. Oh, did you? He said it, he thought he saw a little shark. <laughs> I have no idea what it is. Did you, you saw a fin? I saw a little shark fin on the top. That's why I was like, it might be a shark. It might be a shark. I felt like it stuck to the bottom for a second. Yeah. Yeah. No, I think it's a shark. It? it feels pretty strong. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think we got a shark on here, guys. Feels pretty strong. I'm just glad it's not a stingray. Woo this dude bit blue crab, so maybe it's a big bonnet head. I came off. Dang it. Man, that was a probably a three and a half, four foot shark. Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. Oh. Oh man, I think there's another shark. Jeez. Oh man. I got another big one.
Feels like a good one. Might be another shark. I'm not sure. Feels pretty strong though. hasn't wrapped up this line yet, so that's good. Oh, it's another shark. This thing is heavy, too. There must be a bunch of sharks out there. Alright, don't tangle up my line, dude. Good lord. That's a, that is the biggest bonnet head I've ever seen. This thing is three and a half, four foot long, easy. Holy crap. My gosh. He's all tangled up. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's not with me, but you're good. I appreciate it. That that would work if you want. Sure. That's the biggest. That's called a bonnet head shark. I don't know if you've ever seen one. Appreciate it. Bonnet head, but a big bonnet head. I've never seen a bonnet head this big. Not in real life, at least. All right. <laughs> All right. Big old boy, guys. Check that out. Let's get him back. That was a good fight. All right. Wrong way. Get him in deeper water. There. Ah, 
Thanks for getting that picture. Thank you. Yeah. So that type of shark eats shrimp and stuff like regular fish. They don't really eat like, I mean they'll eat other fish too, but they'll surprise you because you'll fish for like a, a regular fish and then that thing will bite it. Because <laughs> they kind of cruise with that flat head on the bottom and they eat shrimp and crustaceans and stuff. You know what, I think they're eating the shrimp though. I might, I might just do the blue crab, we'll see. I think I put shrimp on top on this one, so if he's on the top one, they're just eating the shrimp. Dang, it's too strong. <laughs> oh man, this is taking forever. I gotta go slow with him because He's just on a Papado rig, probably has like 20 pound test. Oh man. Big bonnet head. All right, I don't want to mess up this pompano float. Appreciate it. Yep, see his head? Ooh, they're solid muscle. <laughs> oh, oh, muscle. Oh, he snagged. Oh, you got him in the <laughs> I was wondering why he was fighting so hard. Right? Check him out. <laughs> He's got teeth in there. Here, come touch his tail real quick. You can see how it's all sandpapering. Yeah, it's weird. See, it's all funny. It's not like regular fish. <laughs> Thanks, man. All right. Another big one. Not as big as the one earlier, but he was foul hooked, so it felt bigger. All right, guys, I am packing up the stuff. I'm going to head back. Um, that was a lot of fun out here. Um, you know, like when you're surf fishing any new area, you can't learn it all in one day. You got to find deep spots, shallow spots, different beaches, things like that. But I mean, first day fishing like a Jacksonville area surf is really cool. The bonnet heads over here are huge. Definitely caught my PB bonnet head. And then started catching a couple little whiting right there at the end. But, uh, so the whiting bite might be starting to pick up, but, you know, I've been out here uh, since early this morning and uh, we're visiting family for New Year's Eve, so I need to get back and check in and see what's going on. But if I didn't say it already, Happy New Year. Appreciate y'all watching. Let's keep growing this channel for 2022. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed. Thanks for watching and I will see you guys next week.